What you're seeing here is my collection of Arizona iced tea bottles that I've gathered over the years. What do I use these for? Feeding bees. The gallon containers that are here are perfect for the Man Lake feeders that I use on the top of my hive. They'll do two gallons. Although in truth, I don't think I've ever filled both sides or I don't make a general practice of it. They're also perfect for the one gallon feeders that I use for Brushy Mountain on top of my nuke boxes. We buy a 50 pound bag from Costco or BJ's or sometimes ShopRite. We make it half at a time, which will make about four gallons, and then make the other half. And so this is about the number of bottles that I need in order to process. As a hobbyist beekeeper, I'm not making gallons and gallons and gallons, but when you do need it, you need to have the right containers. So you might note some of them have a little bit of mold on them. When you have sugar water, I typically try to rinse them out. But, you know, sometimes they get moldy. It doesn't harm it. No problem with the bees. Um, sometimes I get in with a wire brush and I clean these out. Or I just buy a new bottle of Arizona iced tea, suck that down, and replace it. So you can see this bottle here is a little cleaner than some of the others. So this is probably my oldest one, I think. And you can see it's time for a little bit of a clean. But... A little bit of mold does not impact the bees. They typically take it right down. So it's August 10th, 2017 while I'm filming this. We're in a little bit of a dearth. The bees will be doing robbing this time of year. And I'm trying to build out some colonies that I started this year. So I was feeding this morning and that's what got me to shooting a short little video about all these bottles. Hope you enjoyed.